In the previous video, we demonstrated how to add third-party app stores to expand the range of applications level on CastOS. However, if the existing stores still don't meet your needs, CastOS also supports custom app additions. In the app area, click the plus icon, import, you can choose to import Docker Compose or CLI. Source can be found in Docker Hub. Okay, we take Snapdrop for example. Copy the Docker Compose, paste in a blink, and submit. Next, we have to do some basic settings. Title, Icon Path, Web UI, Network Mode. Host port is port on the host machine for accessing the app. And container port is actual port used by the app server within the container. For example, you can use port 144 on the host to access port 80 inside the container. Please note that some common servers already occupy certain ports such as 80 for HTTP and 53 for DNS. The port range is from 1 to 65535 and you can set it as per your preference, but be cautious to avoid duplicates. Docker volumes are mechanisms used to persistently store and share data from Docker containers. In this case, it means that the data, app data, config, directory on the host is mounted to the config inside the container. This mechanism allows for 1. Mapping files from the host into the container for data sharing. 2. Ensuring that data stored into the mounted volume is not lost when a container is deleted or rebuilt. Environment variables in Docker allow you to set variables within a container similar to how you set them in a Linux system shell. These variables can have values of various types, including strings and numbers. If you want to grant a container access to specific hardware resources on the host, such as GPUs or audio devices, you need to configure device mapping. This will allow the container to utilize those resources. Okay, now all the configurations have been set up we can explore it.